I always grew up with bikes being something that I had around me and it was something we used mostly for transportation, but also going fast. I definitely like the speed element of being on bikes. My name is Teal Stetson Lee. I'm 30 years old and I'm in Sun Valley, Idaho for the third Scott Enduro Cup. I, in Angel Fire, I had a crash on the third stage um, in the back country. I'm lucky though, I didn't break my collarbone and my separation is pretty mild. I was trying to come into this race with an open mind about the possibility of being able to race, equally with an open mind to the possibility that I would not be able to. Upon riding my bike, I realized that I'm still pretty weak. I made the judgment call to not to race. Injuries are a reality and you can either stress yourself out about it and add a whole nother layer to your recovery process or you can just go with the flow. Your body always has the last word. I had the opportunity to do some shuttling for a couple friends of mine, Jubal and Chris. I got to know those guys in Angel Fire. It kind of took care of me while I was out visiting. I've had a lot of incredible people support me through my entire career, and I'm always honored when I'm in a position where I can take care of other racers. The collaboration is what allows all of us to be successful. There's the whole Ride Sun Valley Bike Festival happening in conjunction with it. Courses are pretty far apart and the racers are able to get down them quickly, but it's not easy for spectators to hike up and see multiple stages at once. Having the center of the town closed down and having fun events happening all day there, all weekend long, really gets people out and connects the bike community in a bigger way. And it's great for people like me who are injured, who don't necessarily get to race, I can at least come out and participate in all the other fun things that are going on. While I watched my buddies ride off, I got stuck being the dog sitter. Rowdy, he's a lover, but he was also a little feisty this morning, so being the support team comes in all, all different forms. There's one day of backcountry, which has a different type of diversity to it, and then there's a resort day, uh, and the trails are actually a little wild also because some of them are hiking trails traditionally. Have fun out there, guys. Be safe, ride fast. See you back here for a beer and some food later on, all right? A little bit more dog sitting for today. We watched the first stage, the end of the first stage of the backcountry today, and that was a really rad spectating location, watching everybody come into a super sharp corner. I was running down the trail with a dog and did a belly flop, so that was fun. Swam in the river today, getting ready to drink some beer and hang out. Jubal ended up taking second, and Chris came in fourth, so they're both really happy. And then once again, Stan won, which is just badass. I'm so excited for him. I have not found myself to be super bummed about racing. The best bike racers in the world have been doing it for a really long time. Developing consistency and great results just doesn't happen overnight. It's a process, always. And even though I've been racing professionally for seven years, it's still a process for me. And I appreciate that every single day. Riding driftwood on the foreign shores, spilling out into the ocean.